Hello BIM fans! Uh, this is an update from Boost Your BIM with a great new free tool to help you print or not print objects by category. So to get started, first of all, Boost Your BIM is now on Patreon. If you want to help support all the great free tools, free code, and everything else that Boost Your BIM produces, please head over to Patreon slash Boost Your BIM and uh, make a uh, donation. You may remember a long time ago, back in 2012, I did a couple uh, posts about how to uh, have certain uh, geometry in your model not print. Uh, this example showed how to use events and uh, change the color of a uh, line so that it would be white. Uh, I then improved that with a uh, another post that similarly would use events but this time would use view visibility to uh, set uh, certain categories visible or not visible. So now there's a great new tool with a uh, lovely user interface uh, that you can download for free to do exactly this. Uh, so here in this detail view I have some lines created. You can see they're on a uh, subcategory called do not print. Uh, all of these new Booster BIM tools are in uh, this drop down here. This one's called Print Suppression. And here's a list of all the different Revit categories and subcategories. We can come down here to Lines, open it up, choose Do Not Print. Maybe we also don't want to print uh, Levels. So let's select Levels, and uh, maybe we don't want to print the Grids either. So we make those selections. Now we'll uh, print this view. And here's the view and you can see those lines were turned off, the levels were turned off and everything then was put back the way it was when you started. Uh, you can see that's uh, the case by there's some uh, entries in the undo menu here. Uh, this works if there's a view template assigned to the view and uh, we'll remember your settings so that uh, next time you run the tool in this session or some other session uh, those same options will be selected uh, in this interface. So this tool is available for uh, download for free. All of the source code is available for download for free too. Uh, there'll be a uh, video going into the d details of how the code works on the Patreon site. Uh, if you're interested in the uh, inner workings of the code, you can download it uh, here uh, with this MSI file and uh, hope you enjoy. Thanks a lot.